many people have no idea of being able to live like that. And uh, I also made the experience that people came in here and have a look and said, I don't want to live like that. So you need kind of um, you have to be brave to do it like that because um, you don't know what's going to happen and it's completely different to every other kind of living together Uh, let's go back to the 80s. Uh, there was a group of people, they knew each other, they were also from kind of a Wohngemeinschaft. Uh, I can say the nucleus from Saalfabrik was a, a, con a, a junction of two or three Wohngemeinschaften um, and one architect who knew people from two Wohngemeinschaften. They met each other every week when every week in the place of the architect. Yeah. This was Johnny Winter. Everybody has to pay 100,000 shilling. So we made a Verein that we have an address and, and people of uh, official sites. And um, yes, and we bought the old Sachs fabric and, and we had to make our, our own rules for our group. And that was also a process then you must make, yeah. That's a coffee. <laughs> I joined uh, the group then as an architect from 1989 uh, on. And uh, first I was planning uh, the, the project. And after f uh, three, four years, I thought, okay, that's a fine project. Why should I not move in here? Why not? And uh, so I was... Uh, I went to the Sakhalik Verein uh, and asked them, do you like another architect here in yeah. our project as a, as a tenant, as a user? And uh, they say after one year they told me it's possible and so I became a part of the, uh, of the Verein, Verein für Integrative Lebensgestaltung. It's a process which lasts for a long time. So here in the Sakhalik for the first, the first part, we were working for uh, seven years on this project. So we had about 400 meetings to establish this project. First of all, we had a really a group which was enthusiastic. Yeah. They like to uh, build up something new. Uh, they like to uh, have a collective uh, or common uh, uh, spaces and uh, they like to live together. So that was quite uh, different uh, to other groups, I would say. So uh, who is more uh, important, the architect or the people? I cannot say this, we were a team. <laughs> the project that we have directed here uh, is uh, it's the project of the cooperative. So the cooperative is owning this uh, house here. N nobody of us is owning something here. But um, in our membership, we could decide, uh, we could sell the whole uh, house, we could paint it uh, in blue. Uh, we can uh, decide a lot of things together, but it's not our project. Uh, you know, it's it's the project of the of the Sack fabric. Ich habe mir gerade überlegt, wo du wohnst. Als ich in die Misseldorfstraße gezogen bin, wir haben uns alle gekannt und wir haben miteinander den Gemeinschaftsraum geplant. Also wir haben über die Bibliothek gesprochen, wir haben über die Küche gesprochen, wir haben über den Innenhof gesprochen also den, den, den Garten in der Missinhofstraße und jeder persönlich in seiner Wohnung gedacht, wie er das am besten macht. Most of 
these parts are our ideas uh, because uh, we think uh, if you have an open uh, balcony yeah, where you can go, uh, you can see the people. You know each other, you meet each other. And so uh, we were thinking about every space here in the Sackvorik which have a potential for communication. I can't hide here. <laughs> you know, from the others. And in, in summer times, that's not a problem. Uh, um, it's amazing in summer times, the doors are open and uh, there's a lot of talking outside and inside and, and, and passing through and by. But in winter times, when my mood is coming down, uh, I also wanted some space where I can be really for my own. And that's not really possible here. So here uh, in the project we have about 25% of the overall area is common uh, usage. So that means that uh, the whole uh, cost of everything is 25% more. But on the other hand, this is our quality. Die Sargfabrik hat den Vorteil, sie ist so groß, mit über 200 Personen und über 100 Wohnungen, dass wir uns das sehr gut teilen können über, über mehrere Jahre. Ja, yeah, it has no sense to, to live here if you just want to be on your own then there are better places. All decisions we have to make are, we have to do that together. So there is a lot of discussion and there is a lot of um, opinion uh, building and you get a great um, expertise here for just being here and participating in what is to be decided. Usually I don't go to the community meetings because they are tiring and a little bit boring and I prefer to talk to the people directly instead of doing endless discussions. I'm not this uh, handsome uh, uh, part of this community. Um, I'm, I'm something like a, a young guy who's doing some stupid things with chickens and bees and plants which other uh, people don't want to see on our roof garden and uh, all the stuff. Should we have on this rooftop uh, the, the bees, a bee, beehive? Yeah? With the bees summing and maybe biting some uh, body who has allergy. So there were some people against it. Yeah? and other before this. So this is a discussion, in my opinion, is to not have it. Yes, we have a, we have a kind of, we have a kind of, uh, of system. We talk very long about this, that every side who has a problem can say, I can live with that. But yeah, but it needs time. Yeah. So here it's uh, a little bit more about heart and emotion. Uh, how do we like to live here for the next 10, 20 years? And that's interesting that you are dealing with the future user. You are not planning for an anonymous person. You are not planning for an uh, investment company. You are planning for real people. Uh, and these real people you can ask, what do you want? So I would say I feel as a part of the community and sometimes I think oh god this community hmm, 
doesn't really work for me. Maybe I, in the next weeks, I will not participate. <laughs> I do my own things, listen to music, play piano or go dancing. But still, when I go to a meeting and see that others have the same problem and that maybe we can laugh about this together, <laughs> that we can again cannot come to a decision or so, yeah? And maybe there are some times where we say, yeah, we could not decide about this playground, shall it have grass or a plastic or instead of the decision we, we do a small dance together. Then I think it's okay. This community is okay and I am part of it.